639, a violent weekend in New Haven where police say there have been four shootings in just 24 hours. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Olivia Schuler joins us live from New Haven Police Department with those details. Good morning. Tracy, good morning. New Haven police tell me this morning they are investigating a double shooting. Right now, we do not know the location in which this shooting took place or how the victims are doing this morning. Those are two questions we are working to get answered for you. But what we do know is that over the weekend, there were several shootings that took place across the Elm City. One took place on Sunday at 1245 in the morning. New Haven police responded to Quinnipiac Avenue for a report of a shooting. Several minutes later, a gunshot victim was dropped off at Yale New Haven Hospital. Hospital. The 47 year old gunshot victim had several gunshot wounds. However, they were found to be non life threatening. Hours after investigating the scene on Quinnipiac Avenue, officers responded to St. Raphael's campus of Yale New Haven Hospital. A 34 year old was privately taken to the hospital with several gunshot wounds. His injuries were also found to be non life threatening. Police were then led to Willow Street and Mitchell Drive, where they found shell casing evidence. Now, police have not shared whether or not they have any suspects in custody this morning and at this time please do not believe that any of these four shootings are linked. We're live this morning in New Haven, Olivia Schuler, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.